Thanks for watching, folks. We're on Mackinac Island, and we're talking bikes at the moment. We're at the Island House Bike Shop, and this is Casey, who is Mr. Bicycle. How's it going, folks? Good. How are you? Real good. All right, here we are towards the end of summer. How was summer for you guys? It's been great. Been real busy. Um, we've hardly had any rain, which is good for the bike season because... Uh, People are constantly renting bikes. All right, so now when we talk about bikes on the island, we're talking about different types of bikes. How many different varieties do we have to choose from? Uh, here we've got hybrids, we've got single speed beach cruisers, seven speed beach cruisers, we've got tandems, uh, mountain bikes, and we've got a few different types of kids' bikes, and then various attachments for towing kids around. All right, so let me ask you this though. You said hybrid, what does that mean? It's in between a mountain bike and a uh, road bike. Oh, okay. Gives you a lot of gearing, um, nice aggressive riding position, something fast and tough. No electric bikes? No, there's a, a lot of people ask about it, but yeah, there's a lot of do. permit issues with that, so nobody so far has uh, got into that aspect. Wait, hold it. on a second. You got to get a permit for an electric bike? Yeah, you do. You got to, because it's the island, um, there's a whole lot of permit issues. You got to get a note from your doctor essentially that says you have a need for an electric bike and then you get a special license sticker that allows you to have an electric bike. Yeah, I got a need. <laughs> I'm over 20 for crying out loud. All right, now there's a speed limit for bikes on the island. Correct me if I'm wrong. I am I believe that is true. I am not the best at speed limits. Wait a minute. <laughs> Prosecutors, I mean, violators will be prosecuted. I saw a sign. That is true. Um, I think it's around 25, but I wouldn't, I wouldn't quote me on that. Um, it. I got news for you. This is going to go on television, so we are quoting you on that. <laughs> Casey, the scoff law. Don't listen to me about how fast to go. Our performance hybrids ride real good. <laughs> Personally, I like to ride them real fast. <laughs> All right, now how much do you charge for say something like this without the back wheel? Oh, this this is just an employee bike. Oh yeah. yeah. Well, what's he doing to it? Uh, he's running over things and getting flat tires a lot. Perfect. Now you kind of you do a lot of things here. You work on the bikes too. Yeah, definitely. All right. So how many bikes do you uh, in your possession here? We've got about a hundred bicycles. All right, how many would you say is on the island? A ballpark. I've estimated it with rentals and. Uh, you know, resident bikes, yeah. around 3,000 bikes, not including day traffic, which those are the bikes that are brought over by the ferry companies. All right, so what happens to these bikes uh, once winter rolls around? Really depends. All of our rental bikes, we overhaul them every season. Um, you know, a lot of the rental companies do, some some don't. Um, you know, we overhaul our all ours. A lot of the employee bikes, some just wind up in the bike auction um, because we get a lot of people who are only here for, you know, a month, two months. So they right. get a cheap bike and they just kind of leave it. So, oh, I see. Okay. Yep. All right. Very nice. How long have you been doing it total? You're the 20 years experience in the bike business. Yep. 20 years in the bike industry, uh, six year on the island in bike rental. All so right. been it a little while. What's the silliest question someone has asked you? Oh, that's a good one. I mean... Overall, on the island, my favorite is what time the bridge swings over to the island. I mean, that's that's the that's classic. A cla that's a classic. You know, um, the funniest thing I've ever see, I've seen, and honestly, you see commonly, people show up with a bike that the handlebar and the fork were installed backwards, and you offer to fix it for them, and they say, no, it's been like this a long time. I've seen this at least three times. That sounds exactly like something that I would do. <laughs> All right, Island House Bike Shop, you should visit it. How long do you guys stay in operation? When do you close it down for the season? We're going to be here basically till the end of October when pretty much everything shuts down. Right. All right, very nice. Thank you very much. Definitely. Thank you. All right, talking to the bike man about bikes on Mackinac Island for My TV 12 and My News 26, I'm Vic McCarty.